Okay, so this is how to tie your own dog toy out of five feet of rope. So first things first, just gonna take a strand of rope, make sure it's five feet long. Mm -hmm. That's a good five feet right there. All right, here's what you're gonna do. You're gonna take the ends, you're gonna put them together, you're gonna create this loop here, and then here's what you're gonna do. You're gonna separate the ends of this loop. Separate these ends right here by six inches. Right there. And now I'm gonna straighten out the loop. First things first, you gotta create a big bulky knot at the at one end. That's for your dog to chew on. What you're gonna do? You can take this end. You're just gonna create overhand knot. Nice big overhand knot. You wanna try and get that as small in there as you can, not just you know poking out of the end like that. That want to tighten it down. <clears throat> tighten it down, you should get something nice and small, but you know, hard like that. Now, what you're gonna do with that is gonna do it again. This time, you're gonna want to get this inside the inside the uh, center, so it's gonna be a bit bigger. Stick that in there. <clears throat> nice and tight. You're gonna take the longer of the two strands, you're gonna wrap it around the other strand eight times. So one, two, you wanna wrap it around really tightly, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Nice and tight. Tighten that down. Now this one's gonna be a bit more of a tricky maneuver. What you wanna do is you're gonna wanna tie two half hitches onto this piece right here, using this as the main rope. So you're gonna go over once, over twice, and then back through the first loop. That'll cinch down the rope and stop it from unraveling. All right, and there you go. This gives you nice stuff to work with. You want to cinch it down so you can get a little bit more slack on these ends. Now here's what you're gonna do. The one you pull to cinch down the two half hitch Take that one, you're gonna make a loop. You take the other piece, you're gonna go across, create a bar, a bar sort of across the loop. You're gonna have this hole here. This hole is gonna look like a pretzel. This hole right here, the one that wasn't the loop you made, you want this to be about as big as your pinky finger, but big enough so that way this loop can do a front flip through that. That's what it's gonna do. Jump through that one. Now, you're gonna take this, the other strand, you don't wanna cinch down the loop yet. You're gonna to wanna to put that through the loop, the loop that did the front flip. Get that right in there. And there you go. That's your dog bone right there. And now the ends here, you're probably gonna to wanna to cut these off and burn them down, burn them right into there so that way they don't, they don't come loose when your dog's playing with a toy. But this should last you at least a good month. This is a really nice toy here. My dogs love it. Right, right, there you go.